In this training, we are going to treat lateral and medial epicondylitis. Lateral epicondylitis is also known as the tennis elbow, and medial epicondylitis is also known as the golfer's elbow. Lateral and medial epicondylitis are not caused by an inflammation, but rather by a degenerative change in the tissues. Lateral epicondylitis is the most common overused syndrome of the elbow. It involves the extensor muscles of the forearm. The muscles involved are most commonly extensor carpi radialis brevis and extensor carpi radialis longus. Here we have a lateral view of the left arm. I'm just going to remove some of the muscles from the area. And here I want to show you extensor carpi radialis brevis and extensor carpi radialis longus. The area we are going to treat in lateral epicondylitis is this area. Medial epicondylitis is caused by an injury to the muscles of the forearm flexors. Here we have a medial view of the left elbow. I'm going to mark out the medial epicondyle. Then we are going to add the flexors of the forearm, which attaches to the medial epicondyle. And this is the area that we're going to treat for medial epicondylitis.